Right, hey guys, Triff Kutchani here today with we're back with Season 1, Episode 5 of Stranger Things. Last episode was amazing. I feel like our boy Copper's getting too deep. I feel like he's going to be probably the first cat to die or he's going to die at some point. Like, he's such a good cop that he's figuring it all out. But the only downside is he's getting way too deep into it. And I'm worried, I said, seeing the government don't care. They're just going to brutal, brutalise anyone. We got to know where Will is. So Will's fine. He's in the Mindscape still. Government made a fake body. So we learned a lot last episode. Then go to the school. So the kids are back on board now. It's still alive we've got nancy she's looking into it now with johnny so everyone's making their allies and getting learning things together which is dead not, which is nicely placed so so far really interesting and then we also have the scientists going inside the uh the, the monsters like mindscape thing so there is an entrance in there so we can pull him out we just need to figure out how we're going to get into the mindscape and save him but otherwise solid start to it solid solid start to be fair we're near the end of season one like it's been a great little adventure so far and i'm loving it uh, mysteries there Again, they give you enough answers to satisfy, but then give you more that you want to know more. But it doesn't give you too little. So I'm really enjoying this show. But guys, please, if you enjoy this video, leave a like and subscribe. I am trying to do other live action shows. So we're doing Umbrella Academy and Cobra Kai at the moment. Cobra Kai is wrapping up soon. And these two won't take that long to complete. So feel free, free to subscribe because you might be able to recommend another live action show to me, which I might watch. But apart from that, guys, let's get into the reaction. So we snuck into the lab last episode, didn't we? I don't care. I don't care no one. Man doesn't give a shit, does he? I fucking worry. If I saw that side, I'd be like, nope, not going in there. Hands oh up. shit, they're de- Alright, they're, they're whoa, not whoa, complete whoa, idiots whoa, whoa. then. <laughs> Mate, what a savage. He's playing such a dangerous game. I feel like he's gonna get- Oh, if they kill him off this episode, I'd be so fucking sad. He's my favourite character by far. I feel like, how is he going to get out of this? You can always see how people respond, why people respond in that way, and it is a realistic way you would respond to someone, but you just know, you know it's what she's saying true, and it's just like, ah. But. Hate this claustrophobia. I'm so worried about Hopper. Shit. Oh, he's going into the restricted zone, isn't he? Right, we're changing Mindscape to Shadow Shadow Valley now, guys. Oh, he's going to die, isn't he? I see. I don't know where this is going to go. Will they kill him? Will they actually kill him off? It is right next to you, and you don't even see it. Mate, Hopper better not die. I can't see him getting out of this though. God. Well, fucking Hopper, get out of there. <laughs> Mate, this is so intense. They nailed the fellas out of this. Fucking hell. Get out of there, Hopper. Fucking run, mate. Oh, he's gonna die. Oh, fuck. Oh, fucking hell. Okay, they knocked him out. He's gonna be imprisoned. Hopper's fine. What a way to start an episode. Fucking hell. I hope they knocked him out anyway. I'm mad if they didn't. It actually dresses up pretty well. Who would have thought? Yes, keeps it well. After hit with memory loss. Oh, they set him up. Why have they just left him alone? That freaks me out more than it done that. Oh shit, he actually did find it. I guess going insane on his apartment did work. She was there. 
Oh, things are getting so dangerous now. I like it. I like they put the stakes there. The government. I think that's the best way. Like she needs to be calm a bit. I don't know what in the world caused it. Let's take a look, huh? Mr. Clark's oh, look, government. Oh, is that the government are closing in? See, they've got a closing there because it would be a bit unrealistic if the government weren't figuring anything out. Not a government work, Hawkins lab. Because it's convenient. I love Hopper. Hopper's just a G. Fucking Hopper. What's all yours guys' favourite character? I'm actually quite curious. Just put below. I don't know what he's looking at. I think he's got like a compass, see, ma magnet, magnetic, any. I think anyway. Dustin, what are you doing? Dustin, Dustin, Dustin. It's a compass. Yeah, to thought so. Huh? Your compass is all of your compasses right now. <laughs> oh, Dustin, figuring it out. I knew I was going to be when I said magnetic field. As soon as I said that, yeah, compasses. Okay. Right. Which means that true north. So what you're saying is the do you even understand how a compass works? Do Just this fucking AP mate. No, no, you don't because it doesn't need one. The needle's natural. The gate would have so much power. Disrupt the electromagnetic field. Boy. Means if we follow the compasses north, they should lead us to the gate. Dustin, let's go take him to Hawks. That's why she's terrified. She don't want to go back there. Wow, well, he actually apologized. Why did you have that hair or hair flicker? No, I can't say it to be fair. Mine's just fucking my own wood. Money! No! Money! Admit! You weren't here because of Will! You never cared about him! What a fucking idiot! You really come here for money? You're a fucking dickhead. I didn't even fucking click to that. I didn't Fuck's sake, what a prick. That's why I came back and was like, oh, the quiet got no offense. Where does Jonathan want to go to college? We get that money anywhere he damn well pleases. NYU, Lonnie! He's wanted to go to NYU since he was six years old! So then he goes to NYU! She's gonna nail it. Nailed it. Well, right, you're getting the gun and you're getting the baseball bat. Well, Everyone just needs to meet up and share all the fucking details I've got. Well, we paid his phone quick. Man's a fucking mechanic, innit? Oh, uh, I don't know. I just took the gun now. <laughs> Life at the end of a <laughs> Mate, he went fucking ham. Oh, he went for the family, didn't he? He fucking went ham there. <laughs> A savage. <laughs> what guy? Oh, fucking Hopper. I love Hopper. <laughs> He's the best character. Uh, Hopper's lab. We're getting their alliances now. Boy. This is all on me. Because you're the oh, she is number 11. Changed the compass direction. She's changed it, hasn't she? I always changed it. Maybe the gate leads. No, I don't think it's the gate. I think it's something else through with the It's how? Maybe. It wasn't him. Oh, yes. She knows now. Oh, 
But that feels so good for her. Oh, is the episode going to end there? Screw you, Mike. You're blind. Blind because he likes that a girl's not grossed out by See, you. you can't be angry at him because it, I can see where he's coming from and why he would think this. And he's a kid, he's a kid at the end of the day. So if anyone ever got mad at him for, like, thinking she's a traitor, it's just the way it is. Oh, this is just chicken. Stop! <laughs> I like there's a little conflict in the group though. Makes sense. It's an understandable one. Where's Elf? Oh, she ran away. Elf! You dear. So the monster eats then? Oh. I don't think that car did that. Oh, the whining kills you inside. Don't miss. Oh, shit. I wonder why the government didn't kill Hopper, though, and left the... and killed the guy at the bar who didn't know anything. She's not going to crawl in there, is she? Back out, please. Gonna end in a cliffhanger. Yeah, well, she's brave, isn't she? I won't fucking do this. Oh, that means it's nearby, shit. Oh, shit. Get out. Get out. No, not the branch. Oh, it's the first time we've seen it. Oh, is she trapped in there now as well. Oh, cliffhanger! <sighs> hey, really have like a lot is happening. A lot happened in that episode. So we're making de more decent progress on the sh more decent progress to finding the monster. And we, our boy Hopper being the MVP again of the episode, fucking finding the thingy. The only thing I'm a bit confused about is they killed that mechanic guy, the, the guy who ran the restaurant, like it was no, but they wouldn't kill Hopper, so is there a reason they kept him around and didn't kill him? Nice progressing, but I like Johnny's, and, and I, like, I like Will's older brother, I think it's Johnny, and uh, Nancy's a little uh, relationship of fun. Um, the relationship of like, um, they want to get along, but they're still not fully getting along, I like that. And then the kids, I like the dynamic between the kids, like, let's be honest, Michael and Dustin are on board, but the other one's not, and it's not his fault. It's like you can see why he's come to the thought process he has, so it makes sense. Yeah, it's a bit annoying that he can't only just agree with him and, and look, calm down a bit. But you can, he's a kid, and his point of view is realistic, real, being from the realistic standpoint. So you can't blame him the way he acts. Hopefully, they all sort the beef out soon though, and they all get back along. But I don't, I don't think that'd be too much of a problem. And then the elves ran away and we got to know more about it, trying to experiment with power, powers, which basically like. Go into the parallel universe uh, with a monstrous. I guess she's the reason the monster exists, like she bought it. But other than that, guys, I hope you enjoyed the reaction. Please join me next week. And peace.